It has been too long since I last did a playthrough on this channel. It's been something like three, four months, probably even longer than that. I think it was Sniper Elite 3 way back in the summer. Wow, how time flies. Now, I just want to clear something up quickly. I did intend to do a Call of Duty Advanced Warfare playthrough of the main campaign, but for some reason Activision kept blocking my video worldwide, whether it's been flagged up on YouTube's system because they used that footage at E3 or something like that. I'm not sure, but we're not here anyway to talk about Activision and their silly ways and Call of Duty. We're here to play Assassin's Creed Unity. It's finally landed and just like every Assassin's Creed game, I am incredibly excited to get going. I remember when they showed the first bits of gameplay back at E3 and also that trailer they released with uh, Lordy covering Everyone Wants to Rule the World. I remember when I first saw that trailer, I had goosebumps. If you guys haven't seen it, go check it out. But anyway, let's get cracking with Assassin's Creed Unity. is not lost. The past lives inside us. Encoded in the double helix are the experiences of our ancestors. After three decades of research, our engineers have forged the cutting edge of biotechnological interfaces. We have unlocked the lives of our forebears. We have opened a window into the past. This is Total Immersion Entertainment. With the press of a button, you will experience the most pivotal moments in history. All from the comfort of home. Welcome to Helix. Where the past is your playground. Apparently, the past is my playground. Well, it has been for the... Well, how many Assassin's Creed games have there been? It's been quite a few. Oh, what's this? So Helix is like a, a form of entertainment from Abstergo, powered by the Animus. Trying for the Borgias? The Lone Eagle? So obviously as we go through Assassin's Creed Unity, we're going to be unlocking these unless they're DLC content. But I'm, I'm guessing not. But it looks like we've got some new content from Assassin's Creed, some past like Devils of the Caribbean with Edward and Jazz Age Junkies. Never heard of that before. I mean, this is pretty cool. Are they, they just going to be certain missions? I, I'm sure we're going to find out. But Triumph for the Borgias? Sweet. Well, we've only got one to play, and it's this one, so let's go for it. Last of the heroic Knights Templar, Jacques de Molay was a man of principle, a towering intellect, betrayed by those he trusted. In this episode of Fallen Heroes, experience Jacques de Molay's final tragic hours through the eyes of one of his closest friends and advisors. Who goes there? A friend of the temple. Floarak, the council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. Why you're not rotting in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. We are betrayed. Draw your swords, men. Defend the temple. Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Come with me. This looks pretty cool, but before I go any further, I need to put on the subtitles. So, options. Um, let's try HUD options. I would have thought the subtitles would be under there, which they're not. Okay, game options. Blood FX, no. Companion app, no. No subtitles. Okay, then, well, sound options. 
Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. We found the subtitles. Put them on. Let's get going. Phillips moving faster than we expected. Let's follow Dumalay then. Another hand is at work here. Oh, assassins. Assassins? I thought the Mongol Khans broke their power decades ago. The assassins are far older than Masaya, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are virulent as the plague, less easily eradicated. This is cool. I'm liking this so far. We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They Take must the not the fall book. into the assassin's hands. Okay, so the assassins, the assassins have the sword in the back, and we've got to make haste. Let's move. Oh shoot! Oh, and I know how to run as well. Oh no, I'm not going to attack these guys. I'm just going for the tower. Going for the tower. Hold the bridge! Hold! Oh, too late. Too slow. I'm liking this. Something I've wanted in an Assassin's Creed game for a while. I think the last time we got to play in this era was Assassin's Creed One. Templars, though, this time we're going straight through the building. And we go. Oh! Dramatic death. I suppose it would be from that, from that height. Oh, get down. Need to go up these ladders. Need to get the book and the sword. We're climbing up. All the way to the top. Oh, what's going on there? We've got a smoke bomb. Popping smoke! Stop who? The assassins have breached. They're in the tower. <laughs> He's just said exactly what I just said. They breached the tower. And there he is. I'm gonna chase him out the window. Oh! Oh crap! Didn't know there was a drop like that. And the assassin took the easier option by jumping into the, the bale of hay. Into that car. I'm gonna chase him down anyway. Oh, come on, get off the barrels. Just walk through fire. Like an absolute boss. Oh wow, another smoke bomb. There's assassins all around. I'm surprised. Oh! Surprised they haven't jumped out of me in there. There we go. Oh no. So we're gonna get a small little tutorial here. I'm going straight in. Oh crap. Parry. I should have attacked him then. Oh, he's gone down. That's cool. We are the Templars. No one messes with us. No one betrays us. Ow! What was that? A flashbang? Did he hack my system? <laughs> kind of felt like it. Obviously, they didn't have technology like that back then. He wants some more. Almost got him here. Oh, I can dodge now. I'm gonna roll back. It's not working out for me at the moment. There we go. Ooh. Look at that for a sword. Oh wow! That's like He Man's sword. The power of Grey Skull. Well, at least we've got the sword and the book back now. Nicely done.
Pope Clement, hear me? Before this year is out, you will answer for your crimes before God Almighty! And you, King Philip, no punishment is too heinous for the great evil you have inflicted upon the temple! I curse you! Curse you to the 13th generation of your blood! You shall be cursed! Consumed in flames of hunger and wrath, thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close. The Knights Templar, once the proud shepherds of order, peace, and illumination, were no more. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys don't have their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence, uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting.